the world is changing around search because we've got this antitrust case from the United States. We've seen similar cases in Europe when it comes to monopolistic behavior. Is the playing field changing in your view? Uh, I think I think in general AI is changing quite a lot here because we are seeing both the incumbents uh, develop, developing strong technology that's going to probably change the way that search is is going to to uh, to look like and in general it's going to, to change how how we interact with the internet uh, but at the same time we're seeing more and more other companies uh, like like ours uh, but also uh, but also different other technologies coming up and potentially completely shifting how that approach to uh, to finding data is going to be Yarek, it's Arjun here. Good to speak to you again. Um, just uh, you focus very much on, on translation for businesses uh, at this point. Uh, when you look at the, the expansion of Gemini, the expansion of OpenAI and ChatGPT, uh, and, and how bigger the models are becoming, how much more uh, tasks they can handle at this point, are you worried about their ability uh, to compete with your product? I think our thesis is very much to focus on this vertical segment of communication, being it translating or writing texts. And, and we see a very strong case for uh, like really specialized models. Uh, and, and we're working with the same kinds of technologies. We're working with LLMs and, and, and uh, AI uh, similar to, uh, to, to the big generic models. We see a strong case for those actually being able to deliver better and more consistent quality for those extremely important use cases like translation that get used each and every day kind of the same uh, in kind of the same way. So, so I think there's, uh, there's definitely a very, very strong case for that. Yarek, there's that debate which I think you're kind of alluding to, which is do these large language models we're seeing that continue to be trained on these billions and billions of parameters um, and continue to be more general focused, do they become commoditized at some point? And is that why you think sort of these more vertically focused specific LLMs may be uh, more fruitful, particularly from a monetization perspective going forward? I think it's going to be a mix of both. I think it really depends on the use case you're looking at. For for those most important use cases in this world, I think specialized solutions uh, will be uh, the winners. Uh, I think there's a long tail, uh, nevertheless, of of other use cases where, where you just cannot afford developing specialized models for those. And they're kind of the very generic ones uh, are going to definitely help solve those.